inability to live in Pakistan. I mean, in a word, that's it. I mean, if I have to put the whole thing in one, I couldn't live outside Pakistan, she couldn't live here. That was it. You came up against a brick wall. There was no bitterness in the sense you have a, you know, where there's infidelity. It causes a lot of bitterness and you never actually, it's the greatest pain people go through. And that's why marriages, you never want to, you know, see the other person again. Or there's a hatred. In our case, it was, you know, this brick wall. And eventually it was painful, the separation. Uh, it, the, the point is that it is very difficult for a person, you know, from another uh, culture, so alien, to come and live here. I thought I, w I always thought I would marry a Pakistani girl. But I, as I write in my book, I just became too old for arranged marriage. And it was just too difficult for me to have a surprise package. So I, um, so that's when I came across it. But I had never thought I would marry a foreign girl. Because I, my closest to me was my first cousin, you know, when I was growing up. He married, he was a doctor who married an English woman. And I saw the struggle he went through, and, and he was closest to my mother too. And my mother always used to tell me, remember what he went through, never met, bring a foreigner.